Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Evernuff Gaming. My name is Evernuff, and welcome to a little rogue genre game called Rogue Legacy. <clears throat> you may be familiar with rogue games, you might not. So, a rogue game, the premise is when you die, you stay dead, or when one of your characters dies, they stay dead. When one of your party members dies, they're dead. Some, you know, something along those lines. Um, some popular rogue games would be Rogue Legacy, which is this game. Um, Bind of Isaac, which is a very well-received genre of games over on Steam. And Darkest Dungeon, which is also on Steam. And you can pick up Rogue Legacy for pretty cheap on Steam. I think it's about, what, $10 now? It might be a little more. I'm in Canadian currency, so I don't particularly know what it is for everyone else, unfortunately. So that guy killed the king. Like an ass. <laughs> so now we're playing Sir Lee, who is your generic knight. And we're gonna go on in to this wonderful little castle. And the nice thing about this game is that it has a lot of replayability value because it is randomly generated. I love randomly generated stuff. So, journal entry number one. This is the prince's journal. Treason. An assassin is wounded my father, the king. Oh, no. To bring order back to the kingdom, he has sent my siblings and I on a quest to save him. Together, we will venture into the cursed woods and enter Castle Hampson. This cursed castle has stood on the edge of time... Oh, oops. On the edge of the woods since time immemorial. But rumors say that within it dwells an item which will cure any ailment. Tonight I will get a head start of my brothers and sisters and set forth on the quest while they lay asleep. To fail this quest will be an embarrassment to my name. So the prince is kind of scummy. I see you there, demon painter. So if those paintings twitch at all, uh, they're demon paintings. The dreaded cursed paintings that, like, their eyes follow you and all that creepy shit. Oh, go, come here. So you want to collect the gold. To upgrade stuff at, okay, you know, demon thing, at the castle, which you can only access every time you die, because funnily enough, when you enter the castle, you're trapped, and you can't leave. I've been practicing a little bit. Um, I started playing this a week ago just to like get into the habit of improving, so I'm not a total failure on screen, which is hilarious. Uh, what is this? Defeat all enemies? Really, is it? Ouch. That was it. Okay. So that's a rune. Basically, when you unlock the Enchantress within, um, at the castle, you can use her to... Nope. <laughs> you, can use... <laughs> you can use her... Oh, that's gonna hurt. Yep. Uh, you can use her to... Equip runes on your weapons. These runes can be life steal. They can be dash runes, jump runes, uh, mana siphoning runes, a balance of both, and some other stuff. I'm doing really bad. Good thing. A ball. Oh my god. I'm tempting fate right now by trying to land this knife. There we go. What in the sweet mother of God is this? Nope, that was a dumb idea. That was a dumb idea. All right, well, Sir Lee has been slain by a wall chart. You can see what all I killed as Sir Lee, and there's a little bit of uh, a tip. So we have access to right now a barbarian, a knight, and a barbarian. Oh God, no, not vertigo, please. So they all have unique little traits and they all have unique little spells. Electorophobia and dwarfism. I hate electorophobia because it makes the... Yeah, let's do vertigo for now. <laughs> let's do vertigo just to drive everyone insane. Oh, unlock some health and some mana. And why not the knight upgrade? Sure. So now we can block with our knight. We are not a knight. Oh dear god. <laughs> okay. Welcome, hero. Oh, I cannot read this. Maybe you can help me. I need... Oh, I used to be the greatest blacksmith in all the lands. Don't judge me. It's hard to read when it's upside down. 
But one day, the monsters of this castle attacked Miss Smithy and stole all my blueprints. You don't, okay, I'm not going to question it yet. Uh, without those blueprints, I can only make cutlery and stuff. <laughs> oh, you poor guy. Please bring back any blueprints. <coughs> any blueprints you find. Uh, and I can build the most amazing equipment ever. Ever. <laughs> At a price, of course. Dear God, this is hell to try and read. Oh, dear God. Hi, Karon. So, like I said, when you come over here, um, Karon will take all of your gold, because he's mean, and he doesn't like people. You can get a skill later on to make him take, like, 10%, and that 10% less uh, stacks, I think. Hi. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare to do. Oh, dear God. Oh, I'm doing good, though. This is dangerous! <laughs> what fresh hell is this? <laughs> what is the point of this room? <laughs> oh, this is terrible! Okay, I'm access to either the darkness... Oh, the end of darkness. That music's funky. Ouch! Why am I doing this? Why was I doing that? That was dumb. That was dumb. You shouldn't have done that, me. That was dumb. <laughs> oh dear God, what happened to you? <laughs> um. So I shouldn't have gone in the darkness there. That was that was stupid. So we have a savant paladin. So savants cast randomized spells. Um, and all of us, you cast spells backwards, and you're a knave. I'm gonna go with the paladin for now, because I don't like the knave. The knave hits really, really weakly. But when they land a crit, they land stupidly good crits, and now everything's back to normal. I'm sorry about that. I tried to make that as quick as possible, but... Uh, so we're gonna do... See, we did the vertigo character. We did... Yeah, we'll do two more. We'll do two more. We'll make this a nice... Long first episode, or as long as possible. What is this room? And why do I? Why am I here? Why? Why do you have spike floors? Why do you have frost mages that want to murder me? I just, I disapprove of this. I disapprove of this badly. Stop it. No, no. These are easy rooms. Let's wait for them to go by a little bit, and I. Fuck. I mean, this is me we're talking about, but... Oh, I should not be doing this bad. I could I could play the blame game that, oh, it's because I'm recording, but I'm not going to like that. We got a night helmet. Nice. You got anything? Oh, you got gold. Of course, you'd have something, but... Should we fight the boss? Should we fight the boss? Just showcase the boss. So this is the first boss you will probably fight. He is the Gatekeeper Kadir. And he is a bullet hell boss, so basically he just does a bunch of this. And he just looks at you all funny, he's like, what do you want? I'm really pissed off that I'm smacking him. What are you doing now? Oh, damn it. <laughs> Alright, I might not be good enough to do Kadir yet. Alright, so what do we got here? We got a Nave, a Nave. Uh, you remember things with the street? I think Eidmem means they can see where the enemies are located. We're gonna open up the Enchantress. And maybe just the Enchantress for now. Her crystal ball is just for show. <laughs> That's always fun. Hello, hero. Could I borrow your ear for a moment? I'm in need of your help. I used to be a very powerful enchantress, but one day the monsters of this castle invaded my dreams and stole my knowledge. They encased that knowledge in runes, and without those runes, I suck at my job. <laughs> Please, hero, if you find any runes, bring them back to me, and I'll sell it to you back. To 
I'll sell it back to you at a profit. Aren't you just a sweetheart? So now I got a dash. And um, my dash might be coming in handy soon. Is that text upside down? I hope not. Um, but some of these runs can be really fun. Um, oh, I just love this game. Whoa now. Whoa now. None of that. What have we got? Ah! Four missiles. Kick our box. I think it's some of the higher levels, like in the. What is the. <clears throat> oh, that went bad. Three things. I suck with names. Alright, one more. And it's gonna be Lady, Anto Lady Antoinette. Oh, Lady Antoinette. I hope you are a lot better than your pre. And we need to spend some gold. Hang on. I'm not going in there with an amount of gold. Uh, can I get a double jump? That's three. Fi that's three fifty. That's not gonna be quite good enough for me. I might as well unlock the. Uh, I'm gonna spend more gold on the health. Be a little healthier. I have 180 health as a level seven barbarian. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Excuse me, Caron. I need to get through. And this is gonna be our last run. So. Hmm. This is gonna be our last run, but I'm doing real bad. And as I do more, it'll probably pick up. Go. Okay. Got revolt runes. Excuse me, Grey Knights. Oh, no, no, no. I saw that swing. No, no, no. No swinging your giant ass scary swords at me, please. It's something where, like, if you hit big enemies at the apex of the arc of the axe, it does more damage. I'm playing some some dangerous giggle games. No demon painting. Um, occasionally you can find some paintings that are like room size that are massive and sometimes it'll be a superly superb superly su I know how to grammar apparently superbly gigantic ouch like just a monstrously huge version of one of these small demon paintings who I cannot seem to find which is slightly upsetting because I really want to kill one and they, um, other than that, those paintings can be read, and occasionally they will be about the developers' other games, which I think is a really cool touch. Should we do a final boss run? Just send Lady Antoinette off. Why not? That little call an episode. All right, Kadir. I'm really not ready for this. <laughs> this is gonna take like 20 minutes on its own. Uh, have faith. I wish she'd do the eyeball attack I can actually dodge, which is not that one. Oh, by the way, this boss is level 30 and I'm level 7, so... I'm just gonna keep doing that garbage, huh? I love this music. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Alright, well, Lady Antoinette got killed by Kadir. Damn you, Kalea! All right, well, unfortunately, that's where we're going to be ending it for now. I have been Everneth from Everneth Gaming. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like down below and a comment. If you didn't like it, that's okay, too. You know what? Let me know what I did wrong. Let me know what you think I could improve on. Be constructive and leave a dislike. It's okay. Anyways, I hope to see you all in the next one.